Japan is a hiker's paradise. Beyond the busy streets and bright lights of its cities, Japan's mountains, which cover over 70% of its surface, are a world in themselves. Hikers at any level can find inspiring trails all over the country, but for those willing to take on more challenging terrain, Japan offers some of its most breathtaking landscapes. For as long as mountain hiking has been popular in Japan, the Japanese Alps have been the ultimate playground for those looking for adventure in the mountains. And that is where I'll be hiking for the next two days. Here's the plan. In the northeast corner of Nagano Prefecture, straddling the edge of the famous snow resort town of Hakuba, lies Mount Shirouma Dake. Shirouma has one of the most unique hikes in the Alps. The trail starts at 1250 meters above sea level, then climbs up a perennial snowfield called the Daisekke, and eventually reaches the mountain's ridgeline, where I'll drop my pack off at a mountain hut and finish the ascent to the summit of Shirouma, before finally heading back to the hut where I'll stay the night. The next morning, after catching the sunrise, I'll hike along the ridge, hitting the summit of nearby Shakshidake before reaching our high point for the day, Yarigatake. From there, I begin the long descent, with one important stop along the way, Hakuba Yariyonsen, a natural mountainside hot spring located at an elevation of 2100 meters. And after a relaxing soak, I'll make my way back to the trailhead. I'm Joe Mignano, web developer and staff writer for japanguide.com, and today I'm on assignment in the northern Japanese Alps, taking on one of Japan's best mountain hikes, climbing Mount Shirouma-dake. Day 1 Welcome to the Daisekke. In Japanese, this literally means big, snowy mountain stream. The Daisekke is a year-round snow patch left over from the massive amounts of snow this area gets in the winter. Before climbing, it's best to check the conditions at the previous hut. This area is known to have rock slides. about 2,000 meters above sea level right now, almost to the top of the Daiseke. And just in the distance there is our destination, Shirouma Dake. To the left, Yarigatake, our destination for tomorrow. We made it. We are at the ridge line now. Behind me is Yarigatake bathed in some clouds. Uh, we're at the ridge line and the mountain hut, our destination for the night, is just ahead, as well as the peak of Shiromodake. Day two.
just made it to the top of Shakshidake. It's an intermediary peak between Shirouma-dake and where we're headed today, our highest point for today, Yarigatake. And once you get above a certain elevation, the world below you just disappears. Suddenly you're amongst the clouds, dragonflies buzzing around your head. It's a different world. We've made it. This is Hakuba Yari Onsen at 2,100 meters above sea level. It's one of the highest uh, onsen in all of Japan. Probably one of the most remote places to take a bath. I hope this video has given you a glimpse into the world of hiking in Japan and maybe a little inspiration to hit the trail and explore Japan's incredible landscapes for yourself. For more information about hiking in Japan, or to watch another video, click the links on the screen now or head over to japanguide.com, your comprehensive, up-to-date travel guide firsthand from Japan. Thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe for more videos about Japan. Happy travels!